Still with cross plates. Finds Andrews. Andrews forces the save. Noonan can't follow up. It's one back by Heppel. Lifts it forward to Andrews, who can't quite get it under the crossbar. Well, it's Andrews who's on to this, still racing forwards. Andrews and Lambourne has to get a glove to that. <laughs> Darren, another long ball forwards, another one for Andrews to try and win, and she does as well. Oh, and Lambourne with another save. forwards Blanchard's on to this oh and it isn't kept out by Saunders too strong for the Durham goalkeeper Palace take the lead cross plates Still with her slaloming forward, plays it into the six yard box. Oh, and that'll go in off Andrews. Well, she's been threatening to score all afternoon. And that the equaliser for the home side. The initial effort saved, but straight into Andrews' path. 1 1. Comes to a little turn from. Dennis, now with Blanchard, still holding on to the ball, good control and great left-footed effort under the keeper, her second, to put the visitors back ahead. Blanchard skipping forwards, comes into a wonderful strike. Oh, that's absolutely brilliant from Molly Sharp. A turn and a powerful strike in at the far post. Apple, well, she loses the ball here. Palace away again. Blanchard racing forward, squares this to Hughes. 4 1 to Palace. Hughes adding another goal with five minutes left to play. Dennis is there. It's Hopcroft in front of her. This to make it five, and she does. It's going to be another big, big win for Crystal Palace in their bid for promotion. Hopcroft in added on time to make it Durham 1, Crystal Palace 5.